Hi friends, welcome to this class. See, we have discussed about pyrrole, furan, and thiophil. Now it's time to discuss all these three together. See, my question, I have written a question. Relative aromatic character of furan, thiophil, and pyrrole. This is not the question. This should be the statement. Relative aromatic. We have discussed the structure. See, the let me draw first thiophil. The structure of thiophil is like this. Here, it is sp2 hybridized. These are sp2 hybridized, and these two electrons are unhybridized p orbitals, which involve in resonance. And these sp2 hybridized electrons are not going to involve in resonance. This is the structure of thiophil. Next, pyrrole. Let me discuss about pyrrole. The structure of pyrrole is like this. Isn't it? Here, nitrogen is also sp2 hybridized. All these three bonds are sp2 hybridized. This is unhybridized p orbital. The electron present in unhybridized p orbital, which involve in resonance. And the structure of furan. This is the structure of furan. As I said, that of thiophil. Ah, isn't it? It is also sp2 hybridized, and these electrons involve in resonance, and this is, these electrons are present in unhybridized p orbital, whereas these electrons are present in sp2 hybridized orbitals of oxygen. This is all about their structure. Now we need to discuss about their aromaticity. As I have discussed in previous classes, the three classes, I have told clearly. All carbon and sulfur, everything here, all are sp2 hybridized, all are in single plane, and all have six pi electrons, two, four, six. So all are having six pi electrons. They satisfy Nicol's rule. So all are aromatic, no doubt. All are aromatic. But if the question is, the aromaticity varies. One will be more aromatic and one will be less aromatic. There will be order of aromaticity. I told. In case of benzene, let me draw the structure of benzene. Here, it is a homocyclic, but it is aromatic. It is aromatic because six pi electrons. It is sp2 hybridized. All carbons are sp2 hybridized, and all are in single plane. See, it is having pk six pi electrons. That is, they are having six pi electrons. No doubt, the ring consists of six pi electrons. But here, you see, all these are electronegative atom, and the order of electronegativity we know. Fluorine will be first followed by oxygen, followed by nitrogen. Isn't it? For fluorine, it is four. Electronegativity is four. For oxygen, it is three point five, and for nitrogen, it is three. Isn't it? So this is the order of electronegativity. See, this is having six pi electrons, so it is Huckel's rule, and it is aromatic, so it is highly aromatic compared to all these three. It is because see, the sulfur is electronegative, it is electronegative, it holds the electron density towards itself, so it is not going to donate completely six two electrons to this uh, ring, so that it can undergo conjugation. It will. Have little pull over those electron density, and also same same in case of nitrogen as well as oxygen. Those are going to take that electron negativity towards them. But we know that order of electron negativity is oxygen is having more electron negative. Since one which is more electron negative, it is going to hold all those electron towards itself. Because of which it is not that much aromatic compared to those two. So this is less aromatic. Comparing nitrogen and uh, uh, this sulfur, see this nitrogen group is also more electronegative. Its electronegativity is three, but it is less than 3.5. That is less than oxygen. So this will be least aromatic. This will be little uh, aromatic, more aromatic compared to that oxygen. And this is. More uh, uh, aromatic compared to these two. So the order of aromatic compound is the benzene will come first because it is totally aromatic, followed by thiophene, followed by pyrrole, and followed by furan. This is the order of what aromatic. 
the com the this is more uh, this is i mean benzene is more aromatic so this is the order of aromatic and we know that the one which is more aromatic is more stable why it is more stable because of resonance because of more conjugation structure it will be more stable it is not going to undergo any electrophilic substitution so easily because while forming an intermediate it becomes anti aromatic which is unstable so those will undergo electrophilic substitution in drastic conditions for example see when i benzene when i treat benzene with chlorine in at 300 degree celsius you know if we if our body is kept in 80 degree celsius we are going to be burnt into ashes isn't it but see here 300 degree celsius it's very very high we can't imagine when chlorine in presence of 300 degree celsius then only it is going to substitute that hydrogen by chlorine group we are going to get this compound chloro benzene at 300 degree celsius this is very drastic conditions we will tell very high conditions not suitable at this high condition then only it is undergoing substitution and not the addition addition you forget because it can't can't remove that aromaticity you know why forming this it undergo an intermediate compound like this it is going to be like this here hydrogen will be there and here chlorine will be there and here we will be having one positive charge this is intermediate while forming the product the intermediate is having two four pi electrons since it is having four pi electrons it is not aromatic to get aromatic what it will do it removes the proton and this electron shifts here and we are going to get the product like this this is chloro benzene we get this is the intermediate intermediate which is anti aromatic that is not aromatic so this, to this happens the condition will be very high 300 degrees celsius so my point is one which is more aromatic it is less reactive because it will be more stable since it is more stable it will be less reactive then what is the order of reactivity it is easily will tell uh, since it is less aromatic the reactivity will be more for furan then this is order of aromatic let me write you should not confuse this is order of aromatic now i am writing order of what it is reactivity reactivity see first comes this followed by this that is what it is pyrrole followed by thiophene finally we will get benzene benzene will be least reactive this is the order but in actual when we see practically the order of these two will be shifted because if while any reaction if it gets positive charge oxygen since it is more electronegative positive charge on oxygen will be highly unstable compared to positive charge on nitrogen it will be little stable compared to this one so the order of reactivity will be same thing but only these two are going to change that is here i am going to get pyrrole these things you should remember so that it will be easy for you to give any exams and here i am going to get furan this is the order of reactivity and see we have discussed all these these three and you have observed that there the electrophilic substitution will be same so in general let me discuss how they are going to give uh, electrophilic substitution the mechanism for electrophilic substitution see first step, let me take electrophile b y z y z is the electrophile where we get y plus and z minus y plus is the electrophile and the second step let me consider this this is what x x represent let me write here at corner x may be oxygen or x may be sulfur or x may be nh if it is nh we are going to get pyrrole if it is sulfur we are going to get thiophene if it is oxygen we are going to get furan in general i have written x because it is generalized mechanism for electrophilic substitution and this y plus which is 
electron electrophile since these compounds are electron rich because of pi electron load above and below and this is going to attack at second position why it is second position i will explain it also again no problem it attacks second position so here it gets minus charge and here it will get positive charge so what we got it attacked here y plus and hydrogen is here and we got positive charge here and this positive charge is stabilized by delocalization delocalization of this electron like this we are going to get delocalized double bond positive charge will be here and that here why yes and this electric x will be having lone pair of electrons which are involved in aromatic isn't it because of which it is aromatic then the resonance structure will be it will shift here and gets positive charge these are the three resonance structures when the electrophile attack to second position we got three resonance structure one two and this one is three this is the three resonance structure isn't it these are the three resonance structures so then what happens is we are going to, this one will be the one of the resonance structure so it loses this hydrogen as a proton and this electron shift here so the actual product the final product what we get is like this this will be two electrophile uh, thiophene or furan or or muris furan or uh, pyridine this is the mechanism for electrophilic substitution and i have shown the shown you the intermediate you need to write i have rubbed here so that i can that to show the product it is the mechanism if this electrophile attack to second position what happens let me show here it is second position if it attacks to third position this is third because 1 2 3 4 5 anti clockwise direction we should move what will happen let me show you if this attacks to third position then see minus comes here plus comes here so it will be plus here minus and hydrogen will be here and y plus will be there and here we have x double bond is that it then the next canonical structure will be like this it gets positive charge and double bond here it becomes neutral and this is h and y plus isn't it so we have only two canonical structure here but whereas in previous when the electrophile attack to second position there we had three canonical structure we know the greater the number of canonical structure or resonating structure greater the stability of compound so only two canonical structure it will be less stable so uh, it is the electrophile is going to attack only at the second position not at the third position this is the general electrophilic substitution reaction for all the three you can write it instead of x you can add oxygen sulfur or pyrrole in its group so that uh, you are going to write that mechanism and the question i have explained why pyrrole is more acidic or they will ask uh, pyrrole is acidic like uh, phenol why it is so that also i have discussed in one of my video and it is it is been in the same seri series go to my playlist there you, you open the heterocyclic compounds there i have kept them 1 2 3 4 like that i have arranged in proper order there you can watch that video also this is a related aromatic character of furan thiophene and pyrrole in next class we shall discuss about pyridine till then take care and have a good day Bye.